Hello, everyone. Uh, I'm Li Xiuchen. Uh, I'm glad to uh, share you uh, my work, Think How Collaborative Filtering. Here's the outline of my presentation. So in this paper, we, pr uh, we propose a unified framework to study the existing various types of latent uh, factor uh, models from a probabilistic view. And under this framework, we examine exam a collection of representative CF models. And we know that one of the key limitations is the lot function adopted are oblivious to the geometry introduced by the item similarity. To address this, we propose a Sinkhau CF based on the Sinkhau divergency. Here are the notations and the definitions we use throughout the paper. Uh, in particular, we highlight the false negative items as the items for a given user that the user provides no feedback but actually uh, likes. Here is our proposed generative models. We first draw a user representation, CU, and then for each item, we draw the rep representation lambda i, then we transform the user item pair through a function f to get the xu head and conditioning on xu head we sampling the observation xu from the observation sampling distribution here are some instances of this framework first is mf and wmf which use the inner product uh, function f for f and gaussian distribution for the observation sampling distribution a uh, neural MF, well, which uh, replace the inner product with MLP and use a Bernoulli distribution for the observation, observation sampling distribution. And the Bayesian Poisson factorization model, which use the Poisson distribution for the observation sampling distribu distribution. And the multi-VE, uh, which again use the MLP for the F and a multinomial distribution for the observation sampling distribution. It is not hard to see that the lot function used by these models are induced by the empirical, empirical distribution xu and the model defined distribution xu head through the negative log likelihood. In this paper, we argue that minimizing the negative log likelihood leads to either minimizing the score of Euclidean distance or the curve divergence. So to see the problem of these two loss functions, consider uh, uh, there are four users and four items, and S is item similarity matrix. I1 and, and, and I2 are similar items. And uh, I2 and I1 are false negative items for U1 and U2 respectively. Now giving a uh, observation x1 and two model outputs x1 head 1 x1 head 2 for both outputs the qr divergence is yet similar similarly for euclidean distance it also yet similar for the two outputs so it is very clear that we actually much prefer x1 head 1 since i1 and i2 are more similar but neither KR divergence and Euclidean distance could differentiate that. The essential problem is that the both KR divergence and Euclidean distance are agnostic to the similarities among items when measuring a description between two distribution. So it is desirable to address this by introduce, uh, introducing a lot of functions that, that could consider the item similarities, and likely we have worse than distance, which measures two discrete measures, mu and nu, through this linear programming formulation. Here p is the optimized variable, and c is a cost matrix. C i c j indicates the cost of moving one unit mass from x i to x j in the spot of these two measures. So if we 
could define the cost matrix through the item similarities matrix. Then we could use the worst distance, yet a reasonable loss for the two other pros. This is consistent to our intuition. However, there are some challenges in applying worst distance. The key challenge is that the computational cost of worst distance is very expensive. If we regularize it with the negative entropy, we could obtain single loss, which can be computed iteratively using these equations. And in this iteration equations, it involves a matrix multiplication with the size mzxu and mzxu head. Here, mz denotes the number of non-zero entries in the vector. So in practice, uh, nz xu is small because xu is a sparse vector. However, the motor output xu head is a dense vector. The computation will become infeasible, even when the number of i terms equal to 2000, and it can exhaust a 60 gigabit GPU memory. So to address this, we propose an accelerated version of a single loss. The key inside here is that we can appro appro approximate the dense vector by selecting the top k largest entries. But doing this naively would lead to a partial gradient for active head and consequently result in the probability mass leakage. To remedy this, uh, we propose to force the, the probability mass to concentrate around the, mo the most likely position in active head by maximizing the corresponding probabilities. So these technical details can, can be found in our paper. So we equip this accelerated single loss with a, a multi-way star encoder-decoder architecture to obtain our final model single of CF. Here are some experiments. We use two real-world datasets, ML20M and Netflix dataset. And we evaluate different models uh, using required N and NDCG. Here is a baseline method we compare with. The first uh, five uh, methods actually are very cl classical CF models, which have proved very effective in a recent uh, survey. First, we want to verify the performance of a sinkhole loss on a small data set selected from ML20M when the sinkhole loss could fit. We chose three representative CF models, MF, NeuroMF, and MultiVE, and replaced the, the original loss function with sinkhole loss and keeping the other parts uh, identical. Here is the model performance change of NDCG for MF. Here's the NDCG change of neural MF. Here's the performance change of multiple E. Uh, next, we tested on the entire data set. Uh, in this case, the single loss can, uh, cannot fit. Uh, so we compare single CF with the uh, baseline method. Here, here I recall an NDCG change on the ML20M data set. We could see that the NDCG improvements are more significant than the recall. Here are results on Netflix. So here are our conclusion. So in this paper, we propose a probabilistic framework to unify various CF models and analyze the limitation on this framework. To address one of the key limitations, that is, the loss function induced, adopted by them uh, I believe us to the item similarities. We propose think of CF, which is item similarity wall and uh, able to scale to large distances. So the experimental results show that think of CF is competitive to the state art CF models. But we sh also should admit that our proposed think of CF is not 
as good as the sync colors. Uh, but I think this inspires us to explore other more effective items in merity award loss functions beyond sync loss in the future. Okay, this is all my presentation. Thank you for your attention.